Mr. Myron Reed, the middleweight world champion. That's what they call you, huh? Mr. Hot Fire. Well, let me tell you something. There is nobody hotter than the man of the hour. And I promise you that you're not gonna put out this flame. You might be a great champion, but you're no champ of the hour. And that's where I come into play. Leo's dope. I'm actually a fan. That if you want to build your name, your legacy, you got to beat your idols. Although Mr. Myron Reed is the champion, the challenge is for him when it comes to Leo Rush. But what happens when we collide? It's going to show that my style, my swag is more superior. It's Rush Hour, Myron. And your time is up. I'm going to beat him. Exactly what I've done before when people have challenged me for this belt, I've beaten him. Leo Rush is no different. Major time for our World Middleweight Championship matchup. Myron Reed set to battle Leo Rush. We take a look at the tail of the tape. Both are creative and innovative in the ring. The champion Reed with the height advantage. Rush arguably a step quicker than Reed, but Myron not afraid of those high risk, high reward situations. Otherwise, these two seem to match up quite evenly. Who will prove to be the true money weight of MLW? We're about to find out. Yeah, yeah, huh. Inside of the cool alien on top. That little bitch with that bitch in Versace. Yeah, I just put that bitch in some arm money. Talk that shit, but pussy use a nobody. I'ma put 14 bullet holes in your body. Yeah, they ain't gon' never find your body. And if they do, it's gon' be hell of an autopsy. It's gon' be one hell of an autopsy. It's gon' be one hell. It's gonna be one hell of an autopsy. It's gonna be one hell of an autopsy. What he's it's doing right now. Myron Reed, of course, the world middleweight champion for more than a year. Is there any kind of disadvantage for Rush uh, in that this is his very first MLW match, St. Laurent? I don't think so, Rich, in here. I just put that bitch in some arm money. Call that shit, but pussy use a nobody. I'ma put 14 bullet holes in your body. They ain't gonna never find your Literally the two best middleweights in the world. I believe early on it was more. Yeah. Up here in MLW, Myron Reed, the man who calls himself Hot Fire, looking to battle back. Both trading forearms. And Rosh fires back. That had some snap to it. Oh, look at this. And Rush. I thought he was gonna roll him up. Oh, what a kick! Low 540 kick. It's gonna be one hell of an opportunity. He's just flowing so well. It's gonna be one hell of an autopsy. It's gonna be one hell of an autopsy. It's gonna be one hell of an autopsy. Combination moves because in the early oh, going, what a close line.
Oh, oh but wait a second, the ring generalship of Leo. I got a range for each. Yeah, you go to a leash. Hey. Never outside when I'm a hair bleach. Hey. Out there, the hardwood, the tile. What's Rush gonna mind here? Oh, God! Twisting face! Myron Reed out of two! Reed able to counter! Throughout this matchup, if they both been thinking the same thing. Now time will tell this battle. Now time will tell this battle was taken. Low kick by Rush. Oh, there's the Enzigiri by Reed. Oh my God. Oh my God. Myron Reed with the inside out cut. Myron looking for the no cap splash and Rush able to roll out of the way. Bounce back stunner from Leo Rush to the top and here he comes. Gigantic splash off the top, is that?